you for inviting me. It's good to be back. I was here in December uh, for an awesome event uh, and it's really good and powerful to see the youth coming together. Um, so when I was 13, I decided to build a company uh, with, a, with my German co-founder. Um, and now I'm 16 uh, and I've sold that company and now I run uh, another three uh, with a fourth coming next month. Uh, so uh, I've just finished college. Uh, I'm about to start university in October. I finished a bit earlier than everyone else. Um, and um, I think uh, the question of uh, what's going to be going on in the future, I think really starts with uh, lots of you that are in the room. Um, so if you would have asked me sort of five, six years ago, um, if I would have been building new technologies and sort of hiring people uh, and running companies, uh, I probably would have laughed. Um, growing up, I wanted to be a spy, so I wanted to work for uh, the GCHQ and be a cyber spy. That's uh, so not very James Bond, but uh, still quite cool. Um, and uh, unfortunately, uh, I, I can no longer be a spy um, because uh, now people know I want to be a spy. And apparently you can't be a spy if people know you want to be a spy. Um, but I think the importance of when we set up our company uh, was to do something that we enjoyed. Um, so we set it up with the intention of doing something that we wanted to do. Um, so my business partner, he's German, he lives in Germany, he is moving over to the UK next month finally, um, but we set the goal of um, making pretty much £150 um, so he could fly over to the UK and uh, we could meet each other. Uh, and it was quite a small goal uh, and obviously now we're quite fortunate that we get to do that quite a lot of the time. Um, but I think really what starts and what's going to propel the future is our generation of what we do. Um, my companies, to be quite honest, are built on people's lack of understanding of our generation. Um, I work a lot in the marketing world and big corporations like Microsoft and uh, Adidas and Apple uh, really do not fully understand the potential of uh, young people. Um, and uh, what we've been doing in our marketing strategies and as we've built them is we've driven uh, a lot more direct onto online space, uh, building with influencers. I currently run a live show that's watched by about 250,000 people a night. Um, and uh, what we've done is we've managed to change that. And uh, to be quite honest, uh, the people that know the most about our generation are our generation, um, believe it or not. Um, and uh, the thing I want you guys to all take away from today is that uh, you really do have the power and uh, the impact that you can with the first generation to really be connected online. And um, that gives us the most power any generation has had in human history. Um, and I think that's quite cool. Um, so my message is uh, to try and make cool stuff, uh, to tell you guys to try and do something new. Uh, I went to school full time while running companies and uh, the biggest tip I can give you is to manage your time the best to your ability. You know, plot stuff up in the week, see what you want to do and uh, try something new, build something new, use the online space and your skill base of what you're doing and remember that something that you already know and already do is valuable to someone else. Um, and you can turn anything that you want into a business and into a job and into a career. Thank you.